What's good, everybody? The North Father is here. Before I start this video, I would like to give my apologies to King King Vaughn's fan family, his mother, first of all, his friends, and the city of Chicago. The city of Atlanta released the autopsy of King Vaughn after he lost his life in a fight with Quando Quan Rondo, and he was shot by Lil Tim, who is clear of all charges. Like I said in my last video, it sends a clear message to all Chicago people that they are not welcome in the city of Atlanta, Georgia. King Vaughn death also sends a clear message that he allegedly terrorized the streets of Chicago and simply ate ATL after going through recent court proceedings with him have long decided that they didn't want the crime rate to rise there neither. It's clear that King Vaughn wasn't welcome, welcome there. But let's get back to the story. King Vaughn photo was allegedly released by a man named Freddie Curry, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm going to look more, in, more into that also. And uh, it was a huge cover-up. Cover now, I'm not going to go further on and say that it looks like they try to put a smile on his face or something. But in my opinion, if they released a photo like that, it's possible that King Vaughn's body was tampered with as well. You know what I'm saying? He died a pain, painful death. And once again, I would like to give my apologies to his mother. And I didn't say his kids before, but I'm going to say that now. And his kids as well. You know what I'm saying? Because they have to grow up and watch this stuff. You know what I'm saying? And uh, his friends and the city of Chi-Town, I definitely give my apologies and my respects. But I also feel that I have to keep it 100 and his story just can't go any way. His story must be told. You know what I'm saying? His story must be told. And I feel this photo being leaked was, was wrong. This is this is Denard. I'm out. I'll be back with more of this here. You know what I'm saying? Rest in peace, King King Vaughn. All right, everybody. Peace.